Fuck up the place, turn up the place and make them all have fun. How we a blaze the fire, make it fun them. We must up the place, turn up the place and make some sun boy run. And we will end your week just like a Sunday. We must up the place, turn up the place and make them all have fun. Skrillex a blaze the fire, make it fun them. We must up the place, turn up the place and make some Hey, what's going on guys? It's Modi here, and I'm bringing you a new commentary today. This is on MW3 Kill Confirmed, and uh, it's a 2v2. Uh, this is a long time ago. This is me and my uh, cousin Fenrir, also the co-leader for our clan Ragnarok. He, um, me and him played this way back, probably around when the game came out, maybe like a month or two afterwards. And... Uh, we were wrecking on this, and uh, before anybody makes any comments about the gun, yeah, it, this is the first time I used it in this match, because uh, my cousin told me it was a really nice gun, and I didn't realize how OP it was, and I liked it, and I stopped using it, because everyone kept you know, calling me a bitch for not using it. I mean, uh, for using it. So, whatever. Anyway, on topic, I'm talking about the end of the world. That's right, end of the world, 2012 this year, December 21st. Not really. Um, <laughs> that's not gonna happen for the people who believe it. No offense to anybody watching this, but come on, use common sense. The world has been around for years, billions, billions of years, and no one can know when the world's gonna end. Um, biblically and scientifically, it has been proven false. It's not gonna happen, and it there's nothing to scientifically to back up people's beliefs in this apocalypse that's supposed to happen um, uh, uh, later this week, actually. And, um, biblically, it says in the Bible that no man will know when the end of days will happen. And, uh, I'm not a big Bible person. I believe in God, but I'm not really too big on the Bible. Never read all of it. But, that I do know that, ex, um, that piece of the Bible. And, you know, Christians believe in that, and most people don't, you know, believe that. Like, they say religiously it's going to happen, the Christian religion anyway, it, it, it won't, because man has no idea, no, no matter what generation we're from, has no idea when it will happen. Uh, scientifically, um, we've, scientists have looked for meteoroids heading our direction, They've looked for this planet X that people keep talking about that's supposed to collide with us and destroy everything. But no one has been able to see it. If there was a planet X coming at us, I mean, if it was actually a planet, we would see it by now. I mean, we're only, um, I think, four days away. Um, what is today? Today is the 18th. So three days away, actually. We're three days away from when it's supposed to happen. By now, if the planet was as big as people are saying it is, we would see it with the naked eye. So there's just no way it's going to be no planet. Um, scientists have looked for meteorites. I mean, other than the one that passed us like a couple days ago, uh, there's no other meteorites in sight. And people are freaking out and saying like they're going to commit suicide and they're going to sell all their shit and everything. It's just... You're, you only have one life, and I understand people are scared, but I look at it this way. Whether it's true or not, just live your life. Enjoy it. You only have so many days on this planet, and life is precious. Whether you're a religious person or not, I'm sure people can, most people will agree with me that life is a precious thing, and you shouldn't waste it. So live every day like it's your last. Have a great time. Don't think about the negative. I mean, I used to be that way, and I, I would get myself sick mentally, I mean, I would just feel sick all the time because I felt that way. I always thought of the worst, but then I realized life is really precious, and you shouldn't think of the worst. You should think of the best and just enjoy it. And if life gets you down, just think of the good things. Do something nice. Um, I I wouldn't want to spend my last days worrying and freaking out. I want to spend them. I want to spend my days with my family, with my you know, for the holidays. You know, don't. Let this get you down to ruin your holiday because, you know, it's just going to suck. You're just you're sitting there like, oh, that's nice. World didn't end. I sold all my shit, freaked myself and gave me an ulcer for nothing. Don't do it. We're, we're humans. We're smarter than that, or at least I hope we are. And just enjoy life. If you are a believer, and I'm not trying to be mean or anything, but come on now. It, it's just speculation, rumor. 
there's really no reason for you to be scared of it. And well, I mean, think about it, Y2K, Y2K was supposed to die in 2000 because some stupid computer bug that was supposed to launch nukes everywhere. And then 6606, that never happened. Um, the rapture date, that never happened. You just, you can't believe what people say. I mean, unless they have scientific proof, you just can't. Well, I hope you enjoyed, guys. If I made anybody angry, I'm sorry. I don't mean to offend people. It's just, I'm just stating what I think. Um, and if we do die, thanks for watching. If not, oh well. Peace out, guys.